guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new my name is lauren i kind of took the morning really slow relaxed hung out watched a bunch of youtube videos christian and i just got back from breakfast we got breakfast at first watch and then there's a fresh market in the parking lot of um first watch so i ran in there because i just ran out of coffee beans again this morning and i feel like i've been kind of bad about making sure i have enough beans to last me until i get the next batch of them but i'm really bad at it lately so i needed i just went through the last bit this morning so i picked up this califia farms cold brew from fresh market i've never tried it it's medium roast just to hold me over until it comes in it says it's supposed to come in on wednesday but this has four servings so this will probably hold me over until then and if not i can always get another one and then i picked up more milk i love this elmhurst milked oats one it's really good and i can find it in more grocery stores than i can the milk one that one i can only find in whole foods so this one's just more easily accessible for me to get my hands on when i run out and then i picked up two teas so i picked up more turmeric tea i love this tea i'm a huge tea drinker during the week and then i got some of this roasted dandelion root tea apparently it says that it stimulates the liver and supports healthy digestion but i saw on tiktok that it really helps with like stress and calming down so i picked that up too so that's a little haul um my arm is starting to hurt but it's saturday and i'm celebrating my birthday today my birthday is next thursday just move you so i'm celebrating that today with my friends and i'm excited so i'm probably i'm gonna wait to wash my hair and do my makeup until later yeah, i'm just gonna restock my little tea organizer this is the best thing i got off of amazon and it just cuter than having just a bunch of um, random tea boxes in your pantry. Okay, I just got out of the shower and put on some eye masks. I'm using the Pixi Forta by toning eye patches and i've been really liking these i got these last weekend and i've been really liking them i if you have been a long time subscriber you know that i love the amazon eye patches but i ran out of those and recently picked up this and it's pretty affordable i think it's around 20 dollars for 30 and i know that eye patches can get pretty pricey depending on the brand so i've really been liking these so I'll link them. Um, I also keep them in the fridge for a little extra depuffing. But I got out of the shower and I used that shampoo that I got last weekend, the Bondi Boost Rapid Repair Shampoo. I used it for the first time today and I feel like even just after shampooing my hair without even putting conditioner in, I felt like it was instantly smoother. So I wonder how it will look when I blow dry it, but so far first impression i really like it um usually with my other shampoo maybe because it's cheap shampoo it feels a little bit dry and i almost feel like i didn't need to put as much conditioner in after using this because it already felt pretty smooth i'll link it it's really good so far we'll see how it blow dries i was using the monday shampoo don't look at the reviews for this because i recently did and people say that it makes their hair fall out i personally haven't had that issue but i feel like it wasn't really doing anything for dryness so i probably won't get it again but it was really affordable it was probably under ten dollars per thing and this one is 20 bucks just a little bit more expensive but i really liked how it felt right after shampooing and it lathers really easily i know that when your hair is dirtier it is harder for shampoo to kind of lather and get sudsy and spread everywhere so i feel like this did a really good job i usually wash my hair twice in the shower 
one to kind of like remove the dirt and the second to really clean it so that way it lasts longer as well and i feel like it lathered really well usually when i wash my hair the first time it barely even suds up or lathers anywhere so i go in again and that's when it's good but this one did good the first wash so i wanted to share because i said i would keep you guys updated on if i liked it and first impression i like it but we'll see how it blow dries do i want to make a coffee and we're going to use that new um cold brew Just got all dressed and put my jewelry on and finished getting ready. Wanted to share my outfit before we left. It went a little bit more like, I know the outfit last year was just like wow in your face. It was like sparkly, like definitely a statement. I just want a little bit more like modest. I was making a joke that I wanted it to be like 27 and like flirty and fun and just, I don't know, there's ruffles on my dress and stuff. So I've been actually eyeing this dress for a while. I almost got it last year for my birthday. It's from White Fox Boutique. It's a little bit on the longer side. It has little ruffles at the bottom. Ruffles right here and then all the way on the sleeve and it ties right here. And I was a little bit worried when I first got this dress how it was going to fit. But what I like about it is that it zips up in the back but it also has some ruching in the back so it stretches. So if you are between sizes or worried about sizing, get your normal size and um, it stretches in the back. So even though it zips up, still stretches so it can fit you um, nicely. Jewelry, big hoops are Miranda Fry and then these smaller hoops are Lily Clasp. Bracelets, well rings first are David Yerman and then this hand chain is Lily Clasp, and then the two beaded bracelets are Bella Adar. And then these shoes are from, I think, Nordstrom Rack from like a really long time ago, and I never really wear them, but I thought that they fit the vibe of the dress. This is the, the purse that I'm bringing. So this is the outfit. We're going to Kabuki again, and I'm excited we're gonna get some sushi. But um, I'm not hungover, which is good. I'm just tired because I woke up at seven and went to bed at like midnight. So I feel like I needed like a few more hours of sleep, but totally fine. We're gonna lay out by the pool today, which I'm super excited about. So hopefully I get a really good tan. Last summer, I didn't get a tan at all. And I was out there all the time. I didn't get a base tan. It was the weirdest thing I've ever experienced. I don't know if it was because I was self tanning every week and I was exfoliating my body every single week and it just like exfoliated the tan that I 
like got off or what or my self tanner was blocking the sun but i googled it and it said that doesn't help protect or prevent anything so i don't know anyways we're up we're in front of the camera looking like this i only had literally a few drinks but we're a little puffy so we're using this little ice thing that I got off Amazon. You like fill it up with ice and you put it in your freezer and then you take the lid off and you dampen this and then you like rub it on your face and it de-puffs. So we're using that. This is gonna make my face super red, but this is what I'm doing right now. I need to still like make my lemon water. I need to make my coffee. And then I'm gonna go to Ulta when they open and get tan oil and my battery light is flashing on me so i'm gonna do this i'll link this it's really good down below Okay, quick little Ulta haul while I'm waiting for this light. This is the tanning oil that I got and that everyone has literally raved about. Hold on, the light turned green. Okay, and then um, I got, I also got Starbucks. <laughs> um, I got the Super Goop SPF 30. I know this does have SPF in it, but literally only six. So I wanted something to put underneath it. So that's that. And then as for alcohol, I got ice and then watermelon high noon. I got this variety pack and then I'm such a sucker for packaging. I saw this happy hour tequila seltzer and it just looked really good. So I'll keep you guys updated on this. Just got a large pack of it. Um, they also sell the flavors individually, but I just wanted to try them all. So that's the alcohol sitch. I'm going to text Christian and tell him to come over with the cooler. Day. It's actually Memorial Day if you're wondering why I'm off of work and I know this vlog will probably go up a few weeks after Memorial Day and I know that's like kind of a late vlog to when it actually happened but I obviously work full-time and it gives me a little bit more peace of mind having a lot of content that I have to upload so that way if I do want to take a weekend off because it was like a long work week I feel just drained exhausted I can because I have like an extra video like in between if that makes sense so I know this vlog is probably going up a little bit after Memorial Day but it's Memorial Day so I have it off um, I've been editing all morning actually because I try to upload a video every five days and I haven't even touched the video since this morning and if I want to keep to that five day schedule of uploading I need to get it up tomorrow but I think I'm just gonna put it up Tuesday I never want to take more than seven days off of uploading but I want to I just want a video to post every week so anyways um, I just got a package in from Amazon which when it said it was gonna get delivered today I was confused um, I thought they would get Memorial Day off but I got 
a bunch of hair clips for summer. I do love the slicked back bun look, but it just causes a lot of breakage and I don't know how people wear their hair like that all the time. So this summer it's gonna be like a lot of clips because I'm gonna be in the sun and the pool. I'm going on a really exciting trip at the end of July, which I'll share more about the closer that it gets, but I'm so excited. So I obviously want some clips for that. Just like easy, throw your hair up if you don't wanna blow dry it, style it or anything in, if you're at the beach or you go to dinner after a beach day, you know, you just want like an easy hairstyle. So I got a bunch of neutral clips. So it comes with four nudes and a black, like this type of clip style. And then it also comes with the same colors in this style. I have literally um, four hair clips that I got from the dollar store that are like cheapy black and white ones that I would probably never clip my hair up and wear them out. They're just cheap and easy to like throw your hair up to wash your face or to shower. So I never wear those out, but the two clips that I do have are tortoiseshell and they're not super neutral. So it's not like I could style it with every single outfit, but um, so that's why I got some neutral ones and I don't have this style clip. So I'm excited about that. These, I'm so excited about. I know the MEJ clip brand. I actually ordered a clip from them recently and it's coming in the mail. So I'll show you that when it comes in. But their clips are like $15 per clip. And I just feel like that's, it's a lot for a hair clip and then you pay for shipping. And I get it, like the quality is good. They're super cute. It's like a brand. So you're paying for that, but I saw on Amazon that they have all of these color clips and they're kind of just like her clips that she has and they're $18 for 12 clips and they're all different colors and they're so cute for, I know it's not officially summer yet, but in my mind it's summer. Like once it hits June 1st, I feel like it's summer, but like, are you kidding? And they come in so many colors. So I thought it'd be perfect. It's like one for every outfit. And I feel like these are so cute for summer, like this orange. I'm so into orange right now. I think it's my favorite color. And this is gonna be so cute. And what's cute about them too, is that if you're wearing a specific colored bathing suit, you could kind of match the clip to the bathing suit. I don't like to be too matchy with certain things, but I feel like it'd be fun to match. Like if you're wearing a bathing suit that has orange in it and you put an orange clip in your hair, I feel like that's cute. So there's so many colors. There's nudes, blues, pinks, blacks, white, yellow, green. So I'll link this down below. I'll also link these clips. I'm so excited. I don't even know where I'm gonna store all these. I don't have enough room in my bathroom. I don't have to go get like a bin from Target or something to store all these. But I thought they were so cute and I wanted to get more from MEJ, but I only got like this really cute one. Um, but if you're paying $15 for a clip, it can kind of get expensive and who knows how quickly these are gonna like come in and out of style. So I'd rather just get a bunch and it's, it's a clip you know i'm so excited i'll link these down below like literally so i'll link them just wanted to share um i'm gonna continue editing i need to go to the grocery store today probably gonna need to go to target to get a bin for all these clips now and that's about it i need to meal prep today um i'm probably not gonna work out um because if you don't already know, I like to work out in the morning now. So that's kind of gone. Um, yeah, that's about it. Had breakfast. I got a little bit of color. I kind of covered it up with makeup, but like my nose is so sunburnt. And I'm really bad about putting sunscreen on my nose. I don't know why. And I just never reapply it. And I wore my hat for a decent amount of time, but I didn't wear my hat for a little bit too. But I'm like burnt all right here and on my nose. I'm gonna have the worst sun damage on my nose and forehead. But I'm gonna get back to editing. Just wanted to share this Amazon package. It's a lot 
later, I made banana bread, which was kind of random. I didn't plan on making it, but we had all the ingredients and the, we had three really ripe bananas. And I was to the point where I was like, I either have to freeze them, throw them away or make banana bread. So I decided to make banana bread and it smells so good in here still. And then Christian went to go play golf, but we got little Publix pre-made pinwheel sandwiches and we ate them outside in this like little cute like picnic area in Baldwin Park. And then I went back into Publix, got all of our groceries. So I just got back, put all the groceries away and now I'm gonna go back out and run to Target to get like a little acrylic bin. And then that's about it. I've like barely made a dent in my video and I've spent like four hours editing it. It's just like a longer one with a bunch of clips. I need to come back after Target and try and finish editing my YouTube video or at least get a little bit farther. But that's about it. Christian's playing golf. Oh, I need to switch some laundry. Oh, I need to show you guys. It might be a little high up, but that's okay. So I got a new set in from Set Active. If you saw my work week in my life, you saw that I got a green set from Set Active in the most gorgeous color. And um, it's in the Sculpt Flex material. I'll put a photo of it on the screen. Um, that one came in first. And um, I had to unfortunately return the bra top for a different size because it ran small. So I had to return it, thank goodness they had my size still in stock. Yeah, so if you're interested in getting that set, I sized up in the bra. I also got another set, and this time I tried a new material, and I got the Sport Body material. So they have Sculpt Flex, Lux Form, and Sport Body. I usually buy all my sets in the Sculpt Flex. I really like that material since I first purchased it. I just really have liked it. But I love the sport body material. I haven't tried the Lux form. So I sized completely up in both of these because they did have a note that the bra runs small and it does. I did size up. It's in this like taupey color. It looks lighter online than it does in person. I thought it was going to be way lighter, which I'm not mad about it. I love this color. But it looks like this and it says set in the front. And then this is the back. And then I got the biker shorts and I sized up in these two. It just looks like this. And I feel like it comes up and hugs your waist in more than the Sculpt Flex, if that makes sense. Like it curves up towards your waist. And I think the Sculpt Flex are more like boxy because sometimes after I sweat in the Sculpt Flex, it can kind of like gap a little bit at my waist. But I don't know. I'm interested to see how this holds up during the workout, but... Yeah, I'm excited. So I'll link this set down below. Set Active is definitely my favorite activewear brand. I just really like their pieces. And to be honest, it's really hard. When it comes to Lululemon, nothing is in stock in like fun colors. It's like always black and navy blue. And it's really hard to get my hands on like a set at Lululemon that I'm obsessed with. I don't know, I've just really been loving Set Active and I've loved them for, yeah, I think I got my first set about two years ago and I've honestly been just obsessed with them since. So I'll link this one. I'll also link the green one again. I did link it in my last vlog, but, and I feel like they just hold up really well. I don't dry any of them, but they hold up in the washer and then I just hang all the sets up to dry. But I do that with all of my activewear, like even Lululemon, worth the money for sure. Um, I'm gonna head to Target, get a bin, and try and organize those clips because I don't wanna like throw them. I don't really have a bin or anywhere to put those clips. So, and I don't wanna just throw them beneath my cabinet, you know? I want them organized in some way. So I'm gonna go get a bin for those and then come back and continue editing my video. Just got home from Target. I spent way too long in there. I was browsing every single aisle, basically. And I went with this little acrylic tray, or bin. It fits literally all my clips, which is perfect. And it was like six bucks, which is cheap. And it fits right underneath my cabinet. I need to start meal prepping for Christianized lunches for the week, so I'm gonna start doing that now. And then we're gonna go grab some dinner and then I'm gonna come back and I think I'm gonna take a bath and relax, drink some tea and um, 
just hang out. Just finished meal prepping. Now I'm about to run out the door and go to dinner. Christian's waiting on me. 